Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another one. It is auction day, and of course, you know, trying to be true to myself here, I'm running a little bit behind. Or at least I feel like I am. I'm actually about pretty par for what I was looking for. Not getting rid of a ton today. I don't want to flood the market, but uh, yeah, got some stuff. Got a few more boxes back there. But like always, the goal for today is try and find Ryan a girlfriend. And I mean, it just it just has to happen at this point. Hopefully there'll be some geese there. Hopefully, because I don't want to wait for you know all the little guys that I have to get big enough. Um, hopefully we'll find something a bit more Ryan sized. Anyway, who knows what we'll find at the auction? It's always fun. It's always different. Uh, time will only tell. Okay, well, let's see what we got. Ducks. Now, today I was thinking, Bobby's gone. It'd be fun to get a bunch of ducks and just let him go, you know, out with his, but we'll see if that prank happens. Chickens, chickens, more chickens, more ducks, white beacons, more, Ooh, more turkins. I got some of those. Holy big bunny. What's up there, dude? You're a big boy. More bunnies, more bunnies. Dang! Big bunnies. Bread dough, even. You're pretty. Lop. Another big bread dough. Another big bunny. If they were bigger, we could do a catch clean cook on some quail. Maybe if they go for cheap enough. More chickens, more quail. What's in here? Ooh, ducklings. Come here, guys. Can you guys see? There you go. Oh, are these Welsh Harlequin or Silver Apple Yard or Crosses? I don't know what they are, but they're cool ducks. Delawares, Well Summers, Bard Rocks, lots of ducklings. So many. There are some here, Dutch hookbills. I don't know anything about that breed, but it sounds interesting. Swedish, Cayugas, thought about getting some of those. Ruins, magpies, was it more magpies? Maybe those are Ancona, Ancona, Anconas. More chickens and chickens and chickens. More duck. <laughs> Got some more fluffy bunnies. Dwarfs. These things are the spawn of something bad. Those things are the meanest rabbits I've ever seen. Big rooster. You're gonna be on YouTube, wake up. Guineas. I really wanna get some sometime. I think they'd be a lot of fun. Oh, there's more quail. I'm selling a half dozen of these guys, except they're still chicks. We'll see. Last sale, uh, birds like this went for like 70 bucks a piece. So I'm kind of curious what they go for. More roosters, some skittish ducks. Uh, so, kind of girlfriend for Ryan. The problem is, is she's currently involved with somebody. Hmm, what to do there? Bunch of hatching eggs. More chickens. More chickens. There's some of those either blue lace or splash lace reds. Crested ducks. They're kind of cool. I used to have some, uh, I'm guessing that those are Rodon red bantams. They're really cool. They've always been really good birds. More eggs. Some decent looking barred rocks. And more. And ducks. Lots of bunnies. Ooh, little bunnies. Fuzzy bunnies. Hey, dude. Don't bite me. 
What's your name? Gotta stop and look at the pigeons. What are those couple? Oh, just mixes. Tiny little old English bantam. Lots more little bunnies. Pollen locks. Little bunnies. More bunnies. More bunnies. I mean, they look so cute and innocent, but man, every single one I've ever, you know, had or met has been exactly like just the angriest thing ever. Big chungus. You can even come to the auction and get strawberries or plants. Uh, the description on him is nice buck. What's up, nice buck? Ooh, blue lace red wine tops. Pretty birds. Splash lace reds. We got a few of those. I know the guy who brought this goose. I'm going to go get more info on that. Because if it's a girl, we're going to have very happy Ryan, hopefully. Eggs. Ooh. No first. We have a bunch of these. They're really hard to see here. Um, oh, well. They're really cool looking. You're gonna have to take my word for it. Hey, sorry, bud. You look a little ugly. Some bob white? Is that a. It almost looks like a snow. I don't know. Some bob whites, anyway, with some caternix and a chicken. What's up, little dudes? Brown legrins, or bantams. There's chickens in there. Hey, there's some milflers. These guys, they or milly, I forget how you pronounce it, but they have the little white feathers speckled all over them. They're cool. Always pigeons. Hmm. Those are some big boy pigeons. Holy cow! What are you guys? They are big. Fantail. A couple of fantails. I don't need them, but I really want them. But I would rather have Indian fantails instead of American. I don't know. <laughs> More pigeons. And we have old German owls. Love these bunnies. <laughs> there's some money. There's more money. Good old peacocks. There's a really cool peacock here, though. You have to see, though. Couple more golden pheasants. <laughs> we got goats all over the place, actually. Hello, sheep. How are you? Oh, you're hungry. How are you doing? I do not need little sheep, but you know, it's an auction. You never know what's gonna happen. You guys are friendly enough. Dude, your ears are awesome. I like it. Oh, little goats. You got an attitude, bud? No? What about you? None? Okay. Oh, <gasps> bacon seeds. Look, look at the bacon seeds. Yeah. Who's a happy bacon seed? Dude, your ear is not pretty. <laughs> You're kind of cool, though. What's up, my red guy? Hmm. You guys have always said something about pigs, but I really don't have time or space for them, but we'll see what happens. Oh, what are these nuns? That's cool. Black East Indies. Now these birds are really, really cool. I love these little bantam ducks because they have this black with a little iridescent green on them. But the older they get, they get white feathers. Like, right, check out the hen here. She's got a little white feather on her breast. They are nervous little birds though. 
I used to have a pair of those. They're a lot of fun. Kind of miss them. You guys look kind of funky. More quail. Modeled coaches. I like those. Those are cool, I think. But here is that peahen. Isn't she gorgeous? Like that. I bet she goes for 250 bucks. What do you guys think she's gonna go for? Drop me a comment how much you think she'll go for. More roosters. What's up, dude? What are you, a buff lace Polish? I'm trying to film, dude. Be quiet. Buff lace Polish, maybe? I don't know. More Cayugas. And bunnies. These bunnies, those are Rexes. They're really, 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 really soft. Really soft. Um, there's a bunch of hatching eggs too. That's kind of cool. What are those? Uh, bam. Okay, we'll pass on that. Uh, but I do have the incubators up and running, so maybe I need to get something like that. Black lingshin. Nope, nope, nope. There's also a lot of little little birds. Hey guys, what's up? All right. Well, I gotta get back to work so I can finish up my day there, so I can get back here and finish this part up. Uh, I did talk to the guy that brought that goose though. Good news, it's a year old female, so almost, she's probably just a little bit younger than Ryan. Good hen, she had a clutch of eggs, and she sat on for a while, and then something got the eggs. So I'm not sure, other than that, why she's here. I know the guy pretty well, super cool guy. Uh, and so my goal is to score that goose. That's the goal. We're getting Ryan, his girlfriend. Hopefully she's a cheap date, for my sake. Not for him, I, I care less how much you know she costs him. I, I just hope it doesn't hurt me too bad. So anyway, that's the plan. We gotta get back to the shop. I gotta get back to the shop. You guys don't have to come and get my work done. And then I will pick up the camera once I'm back there at the auction and we'll see what else came in. Cause I bet, I bet that wasn't even a fourth of the stuff. So see you guys in a bit. Now, obviously I'm here at the sale. There is a lot of people walking around. But, we got some big old rooster. Holy cow, you are a big boy. The camera doesn't give him justice, but that's a big old rooster. Now, Muscovy ducks. I've always wanted some, but they always go really, really, really high here. Like, I bet these guys go for 20 bucks a piece. Bunnies. More ducks. Ooh. Little ducks. More ducks. More Rex rabbits. I'm a big fan. No problem. Chickens. We got here some collared doves. Huh. I wonder how much they'll go for. Any guesses? We got guinea pigs. What's up, dude? How you doing? Whoa. That's cool. Down right there. Those birds are intense. That's awesome. Hey, Adam Archer, if you're watching, what is that? Those there, the bronze head with barless everything. Like, what is that? That's cool. More ducks. Little ducks, big ducks. Just ducks everywhere. Oh a good pen of milk lures. I'm a big fan, you guys can tell. Silver Polish. More Polish, more Polish, more Polish. Golden Seabrights. More cool duck. Man, they are everywhere. I don't think I've ever seen them at a previous auction, and now they are just everywhere. Huh. Look like cottontails. Close. Hello, bunnies. What's up? The fantail. 
Bro. Dude, you are an old bird. A couple more helmets. A little Japanese Bantam. What's up, Mama? She got some chicks underneath her. Those are fancy. How are you guys? If they go for cheap enough, I'll take them home. Ooh, more guineas. Hey, pretty bag. More bunnies. These look vaguely familiar. Wonder where those came from. <laughs> no idea. How you doing, man? Good, how are you? Not too bad. Come, you come just buy. selling stuff or are you buying too? You never know. Never you know. never know what's going to show up here. This is very true. So we'll find out. Yeah. You guys remember Luke. If you don't, you guys should remember Luke. But anyway. <laughs> He's the one who got me set up on all the quail we have at the house. Big cages of hens. More. Uh oh. You guys saw those goats and stuff. What's up, Yoshi? What is up? Hey, dude. Come on, just look at me, bud. And that girl. Little goats. Couple more gooses. Oh, look at the ducks. More ducks. Khakis. I should get some khaki candles. That sounds cool. What's up? Ooh, yeah. Pretty birds. More quail. Bunnies. Ooh. You guys are tiny. We're khaki cannibal ducks. What's up, guys? There you go. Turkeys. That's kind of royal palm. We have some of those at the house. Is that Narragansett? It might be Narragansett. That's probably Narragansett uh, Bourbon Red Cross. Maybe. I don't know. Tell me if I'm wrong. Well, while they are getting through the first bunch of stuff that I'm not really interested in, uh, those big rabbits, by the way, I missed them by a little bit. Uh, I walked up a little bit late, but I did hear that they went from anywhere from 15 to 25 bucks a piece, just in case you're curious. Uh, anyway. Oh, I do want to know though, on these auction videos, do you guys like when I go through and try and show you pretty much everything that's here for sale? You want me to kind of pick and choose the things that I think are most interesting? What do you guys want? Or, you know, do you guys hate these videos and I just should stop doing them? I don't know. Either way, I would really appreciate you guys' input on what you guys like, what you want to see. Um, I try not to film too many people because there are a lot of Amish here and I, you know, I'm just respecting him. So anyway, uh, but yeah, let me know. What are we looking for? Well, these guys, I had to no sale. They only want to give me a quarter a piece for them. So, you know, it is what it is. Well, I got to get out of here. I have spent actually not as much money as I thought I might. Well, now one thing I didn't show you guys while I was here, I found these ball sidewire jars. Now, I have no idea what they're worth, um, but I'm guessing they're worth at least what I paid for them. So if you guys know ball jars at all, let me know. What are these things worth? I got the quartz, and I got pints here. So the way these work, wire comes up. I don't have any bands with them, but they all have the glass lids. Uh, some of them are missing lids, but yeah, I think they're kind of cool. Anyway, bought those. And I got Ryan a girlfriend. What's up, Mama? Uh, one of the next videos, we're going to introduce Ryan to his girlfriend. You guys are going to have to go watch that video. Should be coming out in the next week or so. We're going to need to name her and see how Ryan reacts. See if he's willing to accept a goose or if he uh, thinks that he's a goat still the last thing i bought those are canada goose eggs 
talking to a guy he raises them actually um yeah pretty excited about that he says they're real hard to hatch so we'll see what happens oh you guys are noisy really noisy hi karen ryan dude we got you a girlfriend hey guys it's the next day uh obviously and this video is getting a little bit long so i have my eggs and let them settle a little bit um, now I'm sure that some of you people are gonna be like, wait, Canada goose eggs, how in the world, like how, what's the legalities there? Um, I had talked to the guy, uh, he is licensed, all that stuff, he has a little paperwork, and everyone that I've talked to at Wildlife and Parks has told me that you can own them as long as they are, you know, not wild. You have to get ones that have been raised in captivity, um, you know, and all that good stuff. Uh, this guy has all his paperwork for that. You don't have to have any licenses in Kansas. This is, I'm just quoting what they've told me at Wildlife and Parks here. You don't have to have any licenses in Kansas to own them, but you have to have them to sell them. So, since I'm not planning on selling them, I can go ahead and set these and hopefully get a couple to hatch. But anyway, uh, let's go stick these in the incubator real quick. All right, got them put in there. Hopefully they hatch. I really hope they do. Anyway, I really should get more stuff in the incubator, but same time, we got baby turkeys coming in about a month, uh, and I can't have a ton of stuff. So I'm hoping the quail start laying soon, and then, you know, maybe we can hatch some of those. But anyway, uh, that's all for this video. So I hope you guys like it. Um, drop some comments. Tell me if you like the auction videos, what you want to see and what you don't like about them. Um, yeah, I'm really curious. So. Let me know what you guys think there. Uh, but if you guys like the channel, like the content, I'd appreciate the like, uh, subscription. If you guys aren't subscribed already, would be awesome. Uh, if not, hopefully to see you on the next one. And speaking of one of the next ones, we're gonna go introduce Ryan to his girlfriend, which is what I'm gonna go do right now. So, you know, you guys wanna see that.